good morning today we are going to see about first unit uh, transmission lines and rf system so so in first unit transmission line theory general solution of transmission line the transmission line general solution the finite line wavelength velocity of propagation waveform distortion distortionless line loading and different method of loading nile not terminated is at not reflection coefficient calculation of voltage current power delivered and the efficiency of transmission input and transfer impedance open and short circuit line reflection loss and reflection factor from this first topic deals with general theory of transmission general theory of transmission line so consider a two port network with the input voltage es and the current is and output voltage er and output current ir with the impedance is at ds and the admittance y into ds at a distance ds from the uh, uh, source to the receiver so this general theory of transmission line consider a infinite length transmission line as a small length ds which located at a distance s from the receiving end the sending end voltage and current are es and is the receiving end voltage and current er and ir so the general theory of transmission line the current and voltage at any point e and i de e and di by ds and de is equal to i z ds and de by ds is equal to i z and the current in the length ds di is equal to ey ds and di by ds is equal to ey Uh, so here if you differentiate the term d square e by ds square equal to di by ds and from this equation one you will get d square i by ds square equal to y into de by ds substituting value of di by ds and de by the above equation you will get d square by e by ds square is equal to z e y so d square i by ds square equal to y into i z so d square e by ds square minus e y is equal to zero so this is the second order partial differential equation from this you will get d by ds square must be z y is equal to zero so m square minus z y into e is equal to zero so m square is equal to e y so m is equal to square root of z y so the general solution can be written as a into e power root z y s plus b e power minus root z y s and the current can be written as d by d square is at y into i is equal to zero so m square minus is at y is equal to zero so m square is equal to is at y the current equation can be written as m is equal to uh, plus or minus root is at y the general solution of current i is equal to c e power root is at y s plus d e power minus it is where a b c d are arbitrary constant we want to find out the value of a b c d so assume that initial condition s is equal to zero so you will get e i is equal r and equal to er i using this condition you will get this uh, er is equal to a e power root z2 of 0 plus b z2 so er is equal to a plus b and ir is equal to c plus d so substitute this equation you will get de by ds is equal to a root z2 y e power root z2 s plus b into minus root z2 y root z2 s using the formula you will get de by ds is equal to a root z2 y y e power root is at y s minus b e power root is at so d e by d s is equal to i into z so i is at is equal to a root is at y y e power root y is at minus b root is at y e power minus root is at so similarly we want to find out the value for i so i in terms of a and b so a is equal to when you substitute the value in the previous equation you will get a is equal to i r by 2 root of y by z plus e r by 2 root of y by z Uh, similarly you take lcm so you will get the value ir root z by y by 2 plus er by 2 similarly we will find out the value of a and we are going to find out the value substitute in another equation you will get the value of b b is equal to er by 2 1 minus z not by z not and from this equation we said that uh, we want to find out the value of c plus d so ir is equal to c plus d so d equal to ir minus c so substitute in this above equation you will get Value of c. C is equal to er plus ir root z by y into two root z by y. So substitute the final value of c is equal to ir by two one plus z 
star by z naught and similarly we will substitute the value of c in d you will get d is equal to i r by 2 1 minus z r by z naught so the final equation when you substitute a b c and d e is equal to e r by 2 or the voltage is equal to e r by 2 z r plus z naught by z r into rho square root of root z y plus z r by z naught uh, e power minus root z y s so this is the value of voltage and the current value is given by when you substitute the value of zr er by ir you will get the value e is equal to er cos h root z to s plus ir is it not sin h root z to s and the current is ir cos h root z to s plus er by z not sin h this is the two voltage and current equation at any point on the transmission line thank you